just made a video. <laughs> Hello, brothers and sisters. Um, <laughs> you ever have one of those freaking days, man? <laughs> you gotta laugh. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> just finished my video. And then I'll look. Stopped recording. So now I gotta do the whole thing over again. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, we have gnats. And when I tell you we've tried everything... Um, we found out that our washing machine is leaking. I think that's where they're coming from. But we have tried spray. We have tried strips. We have tried pouring hot boiling water into the drains. We've tried hot boiling bleach water into the drains. We've tried the blue lights. We, we've tried everything. Yesterday I was doing Uber and then I came home, made some yogurt, forgot my water, went back in. And there was like, my gosh, it was um, maybe 15 20 nuts and they're flying all over the and I, I grossed out I'm like oh my gosh so I I was up to like 1 30 cleaning I scrubbed the whole kitchen floor with hot water bleach all the walls on top of the refrigerator I, I scrubbed everything it is the most spotless house I'm down right now and then I went to finally went to sleep and woke up and emptied out all the food in the cabinets bleached all that Bleached the whole floor through the, the whole house. Windexed. I mean, just just scrubbed the whole house from top to bottom. You know, we still we're still seeing them. Then my daughter calls me or texts me and tells me what she told me. So then my friend says, um, "Try a diffuser with either peppermint or eucalyptus." So went to Walmart. They had a six dollar one and a fifteen dollar one. Which one do you think that they were out of? <laughs> yeah, so I'll do the $15 one. So she said um, that sometimes peppermint or eucalyptus is a deterrent. I saw that online too. So got home, did that, and I have a mixture. And my mom has like two, two sinks together, you know. And the drain isn't just like one just hole. It has like something on top of it where it has four tiny little, you know, sections. I had to put half a cup of baking soda, half a cup of salt, and a cup of vinegar. For 45 minutes, I was trying to put all that powder mixture and the salt inside the drain. <coughs> I mean, I'm, got, I'm sweating. I got, you know, I'm just, I'm just like, oh, I just want to sit down. I want to sit down. So finally got that done, put the vinegar in. And um, then I started making my video. Finished the whole video. It's about 20 minutes long. And then I look and it just stopped recording. <laughs> oh, and then our cable went out. I was like, did we just get attacked? And I'm like, no, we didn't get attacked. Oh my gosh. Um, when I tell you I'm exhausted, oh boy, I'm exhausted. When you accept Jesus as Lord and Savior, the Holy Spirit dwells in you. He strengthens us, and that's what he's doing for me today. He's strengthening me. He guides us, he encourages us, he lifts us up. He is all we need. He is our everything. He's our Savior, our bridegroom. And <clears throat> we're on borrowed time right now. God sees all of our hearts. He sees who truly try. Who want to live for our Savior Jesus Christ. And when you believe and you walk with Christ, you will be raptured. Which, man, I know we're all praying this this year, but it is soon. There's not much news coming out, but um, this article here's from Routers. Japan and the U.S. to form missile plan just in case of a Taiwan emergency. Why are they doing this now? Do they know something's about to happen? I'm thinking <clears throat> the rapture, Russia setting off their nukes, China, if they do the same, or the rapture. I think it's I, I think it's all gonna happen at the same time. Japan and the U.S. aim to compile a joint military plan for a possible Taiwan emergency that includes deploying missiles, Japan's Kyoto News Agency reported on Sunday. Under this plan, expected to be compiled next month, the U.S. would deploy missile units to the Nansei, N-A-N-S-E-I, if that's how you say it, islands of Japan's southwestern Kyogoshima and Okinawa, and the, to the Philippines, the report said, citing unnamed U.S. and Japanese sources. The U.S. Marine Corps Regimen, which has high mobility artillery rocket systems, the Hamars, and other weapons, will be deployed to the Nansi Islands, Kyoto said. Again, why are they doing this now all of a sudden, you know? 
a U.S. unit dealing with space, cyber space, and electromagnetic waves will be stationed in the Philippines, the report said. Calls to Japan's defense ministry and the embassies in Tokyo of the U.S. and the Philippines were not answered on Sunday. Well, actually, you know. The world is crying out for peace. And the Antichrist, we will be raptured before the Antichrist makes his appearance. We won't know who he is, and honestly, I really don't care. We're looking for Jesus. Guys, we're about to see Jesus. We are about to see Jesus. This is almost over. We are we are almost done with this evil world. We're about to go home. Man, oh man, if, I'm so ready. All dead to yeah, But saying Jesus, now would be an awesome time to be raptured, like right now. We had those chem, you know what's, all over the sky today. I'm just like, man. I'm just so ready. Oh, and thank you for praying for my daughter and my grandson and her husband. And so I pray everything works out. I'm just going to believe in Jesus' name it will. But remember, guys, I am going to be looking for you at the marriage supper. Hang in there. It's almost over. You know, the world literally thinks that Trump's going to get in and things are going to go back to normal. That's, that ain't going to happen, man. That is not going to happen. Things will never go back to normal. Until after the tribulation. So the rapture and the second coming of Jesus are two different things. The rapture is when we meet the Lord in the air. The second coming is when after the tribulation. When we return with Jesus. I always I always talk to Jesus. I said, Jesus, does that mean my little grandson's going to be on a horse too? <laughs> um, the rapture's going to happen anytime. And I know we all want it to happen. Like, like today would be awesome. Well, before I'm finished making this video, it'd be awesome. But God's timing's perfect. And it is going to be soon. So, hang in there. It's almost over. We will be home soon. I love you guys, and I can't wait to meet you. Hopefully this didn't stop recording. God bless you. Nope, still recording. And I will talk to you soon.